guys, please listen as I tell you my top five favorite things I love about Thailand. I've only been here 10 months, but I have to tell you it's time for a top five video. Stay tuned until the very end. When you hear what number five is, you're gonna be surprised, I guarantee it. The first thing that I absolutely love about Thailand is the old school negotiations. What do I mean by old school negotiations? Well, if you go to a street vendor here, you can do old school negotiations in this country on basically anything you want, especially if it's a street vendor. You can bargain down the price to almost a little bit of nothing. And you would be surprised at how easily it is just the bargain guys it's really 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 cool number two is the infrastructure the infrastructure of thailand is amazing when i say infrastructure i'm specifically talking about banking internet and transportation so when you're talking about banking you can bank here in thailand almost like you bank in america it's very easy to transfer money um, you can transfer money if you have the right bank here in Thailand. You can transfer the money between here and America. No problems at all. In terms of transportation, there is such a variety of transportation here. In many places, you don't even need a car. You can get around through public means of transportation and it's absolutely not an issue at all. The internet here is outstanding. You can find internet here as good as you can find it in any first world country anywhere. The overall internet accessibility is great, especially in big cities, and the speeds are fantastic. They also have plenty of unlimited data packages you guys can take advantage of when you get here. It's absolutely wonderful. Don't be fooled. This is not really a third world country. It's only third world in certain parts. The entire country is not third world, I assure you. Number three are the beaches and the islands. They got to make the cut, right? As far as the top five things I love about Thailand. The beaches and the islands are amazing. So far, the only islands I've really got to visit are near Pattaya, but we're talking about Koh Larn, Koh Phai, the Dragon Island. I can't pronounce its real name. It's Koh Man Wichi or something like that. But these islands that I've been to thus far have been absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful clear water. There's uh, white sand beaches and there's so much to do on these islands. Even if you're on a private island that has private beaches that simply require you to just pay the Thai Navy your 100 baht farang price in order to access the beach, there's stuff to do on the beach other than just just swim you can snorkel you can dive in some cases uh you can rent jet skis on some of these islands it's just an ongoing tropical paradise and i absolutely love it number four is a big surprise but it's not the biggest surprise number four is bangkok i actually really truly love bangkok uh for a couple of reasons number one is the shopping the malls the ease of finding things and the ease of transportation you do not need a car if you live in bangkok you may have to use a grab car occasionally or get a taxi every once in a while i live there guys i know i rode the mrt the bts and never ever ever thought about buying a motorbike or anything else because the motorbike traffic is absolutely insane in bangkok unless you are an experienced and i mean very experienced motorbike driver bangkok is not the place for you to learn where to ride a motorbike it's just not um, the traffic is horrible in bangkok but you get around that by using very cheap forms of transportation such as the mrt or bts there are multiple stops all the way throughout the city there are riverboat taxis so you can literally get on the river in bangkok and take a riverboat taxi to your destination i mean how cool is that i know people that take riverboat taxis to work every day how awesome is it to get on a boat to go to work every day right that's why i love bangkok the shopping you can find anything you want in bangkok um, the malls there there are so many big malls that carry so many things if you can't find it in bangkok you probably can't find it anywhere bangkok has become my number one city in the world just because 
it's a big city with a lot of easy to it. And when I say easy, I'm talking about the transportation and the banking and the infrastructure, and it, it's not very complicated. Once you learn the system, you got it. Now, I told you guys number five was gonna be a shocker, so get ready to be a little bit shocked. Number five, the fifth thing that I absolutely just adore about Thailand is the tourist police. That's right, the tourist police. Who would have ever thought that you would hear a top five with the favorite thing being the tourist police? Why do I love the tourist police so much? Well, I've had to use them several times on several occasions for several different reasons. First, they are the most helpful police unit ever. I mean, ever. I've never encountered a police unit that was as willing to help someone as the tourist police are. Whether you are a native of the country, like in America, for example, I've never encountered a police force as willing to help me as an American citizen, as the tourist police are to help a non-Thai citizen, right? Of course, that's their job, they're the tourist police, but it is fascinating at just how well and how accommodating they can be. This is a police force that is very, very understanding. They want to make sure that you understand the laws of Thailand and they want to make sure that they enforce them correctly. Now, this is not a unit that has a lot of authority, but what they do do very, very, very well is they point you in the right direction. They hand you off to either the police, an embassy, an attorney, somebody that can actually help you with your needs. They want to help you. It's very different from the kind of policing that I'm used to. And finally, I just want to say they care. Like it's their job to care about the tourists and they do a better job of it than any other police force I've ever seen in the world. So big time kudos to the Thailand tourist police. These guys are awesome. I've worked with them in Bangkok. I've worked with them in Pattaya. I've worked with them in other cities and they are all extremely, extremely awesome. So kudos to them. Those are the five best things about Thailand for me so far in the 10 months I've spent here. More to come, guys. See you on the next one.